Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to tackle the basics in drawing by determining our light source and applying shade, mid-downs, and highlights in the simplest possible way. Let's make a simple circle and turn it to a simple but interesting sphere. In here, we remove the fill and add the stroke. As you can see, our stroke has already a line value. We are able to do that by adjusting the handle pressure option. Then we add blue color to complete our circle. Let's zoom that a little bit. Next is to duplicate the circle layer, remove the stroke, and drag the duplicate inside the blue fill. This allows us to restrict the visibility of the duplicate layer to our main shape. We now select the duplicate circle and change the color to a lighter hue. We then drag this layer upwards to the left to show the dark side of the sphere. This represents as a single point of light in 3D space from which light is emitted outward. Tap and hold two fingers to duplicate the light circle. We are now going to add white objects to represent our highlights. This also provides accent to our drawing. Next thing to do is to eliminate the black line art and color it with a darker blue. This completes our simple sphere. Next up, let's try making a cube. For this simple cube, we have six corners. That's one. 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Using the shape tool, we are going to select polygon option. With this option, we are able to change the size of the shape. For now, we reset the value of our stroke. We will use the pen tool this time and add the corners of the cube. Let's make sure the snap option is enabled so our node will snap in the center and other corners. Now let's select the corner strokes and change it to a thin line. Let's select the cube's layer and group it. Select the hexagon layer and let's add fill. This fill represents our mid-tone. Now let's assume we have the same light source with our sphere drawing. Using the pen tool, we're going to add the shade on the darker side of the cube. We're going to pick the same color and change it to a darker hue. Make sure we drag the shade fill inside the main fill layer. Next is to add light fill on top of the cube because light is more dominant on this side. We're going to choose the same color but with a lighter hue. Again, make sure that every shade and highlights are clipped within the main fill. Now with the pen tool, let's add our white highlight. Lastly, we select the stroke layers and change the black stroke to a similar color with a darker hue and then add value to our strokes. This completes our simple cube drawing. I hope you guys enjoyed the vid. Please click the like button and consider subscribing and click on the notification bell for more advanced videos 
where we apply this basic foundation of drawing in Affinity Designer. Thanks for watching.